Holy Ghost. <laughs> You guys know what this is let me show you real quick one thing i love about working from home is i can listen to a live stream and right now her live stream is a patreon exclusive i need to support her patreon i'm gonna do that today actually i'm just trying to take off my address just in case i wave it in the air like i just don't care and i dox myself just another excuse to move Yo, why does this feel so dusty though speaking of doxing myself i'm like wait there's stuff on the screen Editing Alicia will remember to send for it. Oh, I can already smell it. It smells so amazing. This is what the card looks like. My Patreons surprised me with a subscription. So you're going to be seeing a lot of these in the upcoming vlogs. This one is called Nativa Jamaica. And honestly, I mean, I'm already overdue for a vacation because it's been three years. This is why I can't get a lunch break. Always messages coming in. They were gonna send it in the same package as this. You know, it's funny, I packed this to work. So I'm like, you know, sometimes I'm at work and I get a little anxious. You know when you get anxious, you get a little sweaty killer. I like that they give you this little plastic container, but it didn't help me because I was looking for something in my backpack. It dropped out, it popped out, it cracked. But I mean, it still closes. Scentbird is so sweet. I told them that I like this, but I don't love it since they picked it for me and they're like, okay, choose one because you're new to the fam. And of course, they'd rather keep a client than lose someone. So let's see, because I haven't put a fragrance on today. And let me not spray my lens like I did a couple of vlogs ago. Oh, see? And this is why, don't let them choose for you. This is what I'm talking about. I'm about to swap this out because this is the type of perfume I would take with me. It is exactly as described. It's literally a vacation in a scent. I'm about to book a solo trip off of this. That's how good it is. You're upside down, probably. Okay, so the notes on Sativa Jamaica are, okay, film, can you zoom in? What does that even say? Okay, I know I'm blind, but I don't know what that is. Win Vite, that's probably not at all how you say it. Must. Vanilla, Vetiver, Plumeria, Plumeria. Siri, what is vetiver? Oh, maybe it is pronounced vetiver. It says it's a species of plant. You're looking for summer fragrance? Scentbird just got one with this one. almost one it's a gloomy day so let's get some rainy day ramen and probably a coffee because you see me on it it's one of those days photo inception <laughs> French. Mm. this is for her birthday that's cheap perfume under $100 it's not perfume wear that sucks then Oh, yeah. Thank you. What up, TikTok? TikTok? Yeah, I know you're doing TikToks. <laughs> do you have a TikTok yet? Yeah, I do. How many followers you got? My hands are so ugly, but whatever. So lit. showed you in the vlogs because she doesn't really like being in the vlogs like that so you probably won't see her today but I think that was the first week of January because then I took my little break and I haven't seen her since so wow it's been more than two months that's crazy so yeah we're gonna catch up and I'm a little exhausted so I think I'm gonna make a latte later on 
but I'm not sure if it's cold or if it's just because it's cold in here because a lot of times I think it's freezing outside, but of course, because you have a jacket outside, it's not that cold because it's so cold in here, I never know. Plus, the way the wind and the gust was coming through the draft in the door, Arctic out there, it has to be. I was up until 4 a.m. binge watching Your Honor season two. I didn't even know it dropped, so I had a lot to catch up on. That show is crazy. See, if you haven't seen it, I won't spoil it for you, but if you like a good thriller, crime, all types-ish type of show, there's only two seasons, definitely check it out and let me know. I can't remember if I told you, but they came, I don't remember if it was yesterday or the day before all the days are blurring into one. The pandemic is just one big year. Am I allowed to say that word now or do I still get flagged for it? But they said they measured the door, so let's see if they replace it. And let's see if they actually turn the heat on enough so that it's actually warm in here. Because it's kind of illegal. I'm not going to go on that rant anymore because I promised I wouldn't. It's kind of hard because you know your home is supposed to be your haven. A lot of things don't go your way, but you have to make the best out of it to get to the next stage. Not this plantain starting to go like this. Time to cook it real quick. Ooh, this is not the way to open this. I can tell you that much. You know what I should have done? I should have sliced it down the middle like a normal person. Or cleaning more than cooking, which says a lot because I don't like cleaning either. I think it was so much easier. I don't know why I make my life more difficult. Whoa, it really does smell like home insurance is about to go up. If you watch the vlog where I was house hunting with Genevieve, a lot of those places were 22, 2250, 30. 2300 and up. They were further from here. Oh my, I don't think I need to live here anymore. It's cool when I worked in the neighborhood and I walked to work every single day. Luxury. There's different types of luxury. One day we have to do a sit down video about that. Luxury is not always a Gucci bag. Sometimes it's the ability to wake up, go to the gym, and walk to work. Simple things. I love these kitchen chats. I miss them. I haven't done them in a while because honestly, when I'm editing, this is so embarrassing to admit, I feel a sense of shame for my setup. I like to be in the vlog, so I'll just see your hands. <laughs> I just feel like I never look like I never dressed up anymore. Things are different after the pandemic. Yeah. And everyone's priorities are different now. Why is this so creaky? Afternoon loves, hope your Sunday is going well so far. From the sounds of it, it's a windy one out there. I'm trying to be healthy as you can see. I hate salads, what is this? Qu'est-ce I prefer my vegetables hot and seasoned, okay? But you know what, every once in a while, a little rabbit food never hurt anyone. It's so funny, I study nutrition, but I can't stand salads or sandwiches. What's your favorite food? Mine has to be Caribbean, Thai, Indian. All saucy, all spicy, all flavorful. All this chewing for no flavor, but anyway. Yesterday was good. I'm glad I got to see my friend. It was so bad coming home because we have shuttle buses every other weekend. What? I'm not getting into that. So I'm thinking about getting a couple errands done. I was thinking about getting contact paper and covering this up. But then I'm also thinking, what's the point of that? Because I'm not trying to stay here. But then I'm thinking, as long as I stay here, I should optimize, maybe even get peel and stick flooring. But then I'm just thinking, the money that I would spend for that, I checked Amazon, it ain't cheap. I thought it would be. I mean, it's cheaper than real flooring, but still, it'd be like two, three hundred dollars. No problem. God bless you, dear, always. Hope you feel better. Okay, we yes, my dear, thank you. Love you, great grandma. Leave it to my love. God bless you, and I love you very much. Okay? Yes, take care. Alright, my love. Now I'm gonna drop it on camera. Gentlemen. Are these the right yeah, fake ones that like work just as good as the real ones in Thailand for like forty dollars. Yeah, because they're like all made in China. Oh, gangsters though. So. From the side, sir.
since the last place closed 20 minutes after we got there. It's a nice treat to come and visit. Wait, I can't film you back? <laughs> Honestly, maybe Mans just wanted to go to Thailand, man. Uh, oh, to pour it out? Yeah, look. Look at this. Look no, at yeah, no, man. I'm not doing that. You want to get some views? No, no views. PG, okay? Well, let's spice it up. birthday is tomorrow, but I wanted to drop those off today so she has something pretty to wake up to. And as you saw, I also went to Bean Wise, which is the best coffee store in Essex, and got this, which I should probably tell you what it is. It is, oh, I didn't realize there's five. I zoomed in, and it's macadamia nut, marshmallow, peppermint, which I don't know. I'm not really big on peppermint coffee or peppermint hot chocolate. There's dark chocolate, and there's one other one I can't remember. But I can always zoom in and show you guys later. I think this one's macadamia nut. Or is it this one? I can't remember. But that's the same flavor of the latte I had yesterday, so I'm so excited for it. There's syrups, since you know I'm a coffee fiend. But I was actually thinking these would be perfect to flavor my matchas that I take with me to work. <sighs> what some fresh air will do for you, though. I was so anxious this morning. I'm talking I nearly fainted off the elliptical. My heart was beating after my workout like I was still working out and I just had to slow down my breathing and my thoughts. I'll tell you more about it later. I have worn these pants three times in the last two weeks because I love how comfy they are and they're still cheap. Hello, hello. I figure since I'm in the neighborhood, I might as well see if they have contact paper. The last time I was here, I swear this place was called Rona though, but when I looked, I think it said Lowe's, so I don't know. But anyways, let's see if we can find it. I can't wait till I have an apartment where I can pick my lighting. I wish I could have a nice stove or a nice fridge. Okay, maybe not this big though. That's like family of six or something. Oh my gosh, white fridges are still a thousand dollars? I wonder if this one is as loud as mine at home. This kitchen is bigger than my bachelor. I love the backsplash. I love the countertop. It's so pretty. So much for that. I'm at the second hardware store and they don't have it here either. I just wanted to get some countertop contact paper to improve the way my kitchen looks just a little bit, but hey. I guess it's Amazon. I'm home. Contact paper. Mm, they didn't have that, but I was able to go to the grocery store. My brother helped me bring the groceries back. So on his way home, I'm going to make a quick dinner because I got to straighten my hair, finish up something for work, and I got to do my two pods. That's a lot for the night. So let's get into it. Ah, I keep forgetting to buy the oil. I think today was definitely a lesson in learning how to be happy with what is so that when you receive better, you really appreciate it. That's how I'm taking the message. where I cue the really cool transition where my hair is straightened, but uh, that didn't happen today. Nope. Stay blessed, stay authentic. My self cure journal. What time is it? I still have to edit these. Oh my goodness, it's 121. Yeah, definitely not straightening my hair right now. I have to wake up and be in office by 845. I have four meetings tomorrow. What do you mean they're opening up? It's already open, but they're official oh, yeah, opening, yeah, yeah. I wanted to wait, but I couldn't. I put this in my matcha this morning, and now for my latte. Let's try this one. Put toasted marshmallow in my matcha today. Unreal. It was so good. Don't mind. Don't mind this. I figure I might as well finally deep condition my hair. I'm trying this. Have you ever heard of it before? You know, there's so many times when I want to show you something so you can get a whiff and a sniff. 
Like even my essential oils right now are so amazing. It's called Ohm. You can't get it at Sage anymore, but it's so relaxing. I wish you guys could smell it. But the way my hair product smells, that's something I'm happy that doesn't translate through the camera. Anyway, hope you guys are having a good week so far. It's crazy. Time flies. I feel like I say that every vlog, so <laughs> we just get back to it. And I got a lot to do. Once I'm done work, I'm going to go downstairs and start to do laundry. I got two big bags. I hope you can't see them back there. It's way overdue. So I'm going to do my loads of laundry and then straighten my hair. And I want to plan some stuff and get my vlog up. So it's a busy one. You probably won't see too much of me today, but I still wanted to check in and say, hey. Express or Alibaba, whichever one I never remember which one it is. It's like Kinder Surprise, you never remember what you're gonna get because it's been so long. <laughs> you remember those chocolates? I ordered this how many months ago, but it comes from China on a boat, so you know, sometimes it doesn't even ship. But if you watched my first vlog at the top this year, you know, I ordered a hot pink see through one, and I figured, you know what. Since this is made kind of like a one-time plastic, once you snap, it's locked in. I have a feeling if I keep opening that one to refill it, it's going to start leaking. So I got this one as a backup, and I think it's very sleek and sophisticated with the matte black. But that's that on that. Out with the old, in with the new. My big head keeps stretching these out. Let's see how long this one lasts. My face like that. I should do like a skincare commercial. Like, I'm, I don't know. I don't have time like that when it comes to skin here. I feel like I spend so much time on other things that when it comes to this part of our regimen, I'm just so quick with it. Maybe I should be more intentional. Ever since I started using that self-care journal, it has me thinking more than ever before. The first question is, what's your intention of the day? That's why. But I'll think about that several times throughout the day. What's your intention for the day generally? Mine is always to try to be better than I was yesterday. Ah! Again! Fail! Fail! With that new version of yourself that you're working on, may I bring a life being in joy of happiness, good health, and freedom, and to make my thoughts, my words, and my actions contribute to that universal state of love, peace, and happiness. Get started. I just finished the gym. Happy Friday, guys. Oh, Lord, please deliver me from Egypt. <laughs> Who am I? Why am I saying this? It's not, is it ever that serious? I mean, it kind of is. No lie. I they were usable bags. I'm talking about plastic bags. That's what I'm talking No, I'm talking about plastic bags. Oh, I'm from like the grocery store. I, because you, you never know what you need them for. I use them for little garbage cans. Little girls were hospitalized mm -hmm. with anxiety. After playing with a Ouija board, <laughs> nearly 30 school girls. I should laugh, but come on. Up. Are you serious? In color. Paranormal activity. Yeah. And I was like, nope, never watch you know, Same. Never, never again. Never, yeah. ever again. watch my vlog ooh, was it a month ago or two now I try to go there on a Monday only to find out when I got there they're not open on Mondays so I'm happy that I was like you know what I'm going today 
they were so nice in there as I was putting this on. I was like, I love your cardigan, thanks. And then they had a customer who was leaving. Oh, I love your kicks. I was like, thanks. They were just regular Nikes. <laughs> and then as I was leaving, the girl was like, I was watching you through the window. I love your set. Where is it from? I'm like, where are all these compliments coming from? What a way to make a girl's day, eh? You're a weirdo when you put the rest of your croissant in your bag. I don't know if I'm the only person who's like this, but the later I'm up, the more creative I become, even though this is not really creative work. Once I switched this computer off, I was thinking about, okay, how am I gonna make YouTube pop? What am I gonna do on TikTok? And I came up with all these ideas, but then when I woke up this morning, I'm like, they're creative, yes, but it doesn't mean they translate to something anyone else is interested in. So I'm thinking, perhaps my TikTok will be, another message, perhaps my TikTok will be, I need to wipe this phone. <laughs> so much is going on. Let me just say what I need to say because I'm gonna be like editing the ish out of this clip. That's another thing. Sometimes I'm vlogging and I'm talking so much that when I'm editing, I'm like, girl, just get to the point. I kind of want my TikTok to be a mashup of just random things like my thoughts of the days or hacks I have or what it's like to live life with you blind. I don't know if I'm gonna vlog as much in the future to be honest with you guys. It does take a long time. A long time, time out of the day, a long time to edit, okay, but it is fun and I, I like vlogging because we get to talk about things that I would never make a dedicated video about. Ooh, that croissant was so good, but I think it was too sweet. My tummy's hurting. Oh, sugar crap. It's probably not even the sugar, it's probably just my cycle wreaking habit on my whole life. You know? Being a woman is no joke. Oh shoot, really? But it's not, but pineapple's my most favorite one. Okay, I knew pineapple, but I was like, okay, yeah. the most adjacent but I don't one really to pineapple. Like, but, I, <laughs> but I don't dislike any of them. Uh, you guys just passed through, and I haven't edited that vlog yet. It will more than likely explode. Holy ghost. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to get cough right clean. No, I'm pretty good at it. I don't know if you want chips. I'm not good. I'm actually the same. A ton of chips. I don't need any of this then. Ah. What's been the most interesting part of your week? Um, town hall. We had another town hall, but it was only one of my teams. Because usually it's both of my teams and there's, I don't know, I'll say a hundred people, which is not a lot, but it's a lot post-pandemic. Oh, I didn't put... What? I was supposed to put the avocado oil on it first. Oh. I was so happy. Not just, bougie. It's I okay. will still put it on it, but it's gonna, it's the wrong order. It's gonna bother me. I made it with my popcorn machine, remember? Oh, yeah. get in the bag. It's cheaper if you do the machine, but. I just like it because I can control the quantity. Because oh. if you weren't here, I would have eaten this already and made a second one. Yeah. But I didn't eat See, any I have of it. Popcorn was on sale the other day, so I bought like. Oh, yeah? Throw the white cheddar seasoning inside the bag and then just close up the bag. <laughs> And then... <laughs> With the sound effects, too. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers to Friday. Okay. Oh, I need okay. to play a song. Um, what is it going to be? Friday. Um, not Rebecca Black's Friday, right? No, no, no. no. Okay, thank God, because that was a moment all millennials need to forget. You and this light. I feel like my light is so stark. Do you need your honor, or no? Oh, no. I have the outside lights on to provide all the This is why I don't go to clubs. When's the last time you went to a club? Oh my god, your head is cut off. I'm <laughs> I never heard this before. Good morning. It's a gloomy one. <sighs> Happy Saturday. Yesterday was so much fun. Kevin knows how to start a weekend. That Prosecco though. Whew. I'm a lightweight because I don't drink much anymore. Ever since that Daniel passed, you know. Anywho, as you can see, I got my set because I'm ready to do some sets. Only thing is, how am I going to get downstairs because the power just went out? I was in the washroom, the lights started flickering like a horror movie, and then it went out, and I heard dogs barking, people coming out of the units. And I was like, okay, it's not just me. We're going to go to an event. There's an antique and a Barbuda event. That's the country my mom was born. Let there be light, okay. So I don't have to worry about the elevators. They're definitely going to work now. Let me turn this off. And see ya when I get back. 
So I'm thinking I might wear this since I haven't worn this shirt in a minute. It's funny, when I first get a piece, I wear it every week and then it's just in my closet, untouched. But I don't know if this even goes with the vibe of the event. But I know what does, angel share. I always have to feel around to see where the actual spray part is. I've sprayed my eye before. This one gets stronger the longer you have it. I thought it was just me. But there's this girl who does really good perfume reviews on YouTube, and she said it too, so I know I'm not crazy. I might switch my fit, so you might have to help me pick. But first, let's journal a little bit. My self-care journal last night, or did I even do it yesterday for the day before? I can't even remember at this point, and I can't just look to see, because that's not how things are for me anymore. I'm going to have to zoom in to see what the last date is. Like, start with something as simple as, what's your favorite cuisine? Most people go, I don't know what my favorite cuisine That's so cute. Try and find those patterns in your life because all of us have a karmic pattern in our life that we just not zoned into. Look at the three decisions you made in your life where you knew it was the best decision when you made it, not when you got the best. You're just inexperienced at it. That second element of you don't have to be the best at something when you start doing it, but as soon as you start doing it, you've now given yourself that opportunity to grow. This is going to be my final answer. I don't know, I just felt like that shirt was too office. Maybe because like I said, I used to always wear it in the office. I'm just gonna add a little shine serum to the hair, pack my purse. I don't know which one to wear. Depending on how cold it is, it may be the blue one to go with my blue coat or it might be the black one. Well, now that I'm wearing color, maybe I should just stick with black. And that'll be that, which means I have to take my card holder out and my business cards. People still pass out business cards. It might not even be that kind of event. It might just be like a chill lime type of thing. And hopefully I can catch an accent because my accent, I'm just, I'm just through and through Canadian. It's so sad. <laughs> I wish I had an Antiguan accent. Events for my friends, like baby showers where I didn't know anyone but the person. So I had to get acquainted with their friends, but I've never gone anywhere completely by myself before. A little nervous, okay. We're good, right? <laughs> I don't know, I feel like it's weird tied like this, but if I do anything else, I'm just gonna be here all day, so let's go. All right, thank you, Alicia. Hey, Gavin, I'm the chair, co chair of the association. Uh, I have Manel Williams here. We're gonna have a small fireside chat along with Carrie Billy Lewis, um, and they'll share some of their knowledge with us. So this will be the quieter part of the event. Everything else will be more fast-paced. I'm a life speaker, educator, and I help people plan their legacies. Good evening, everyone. My name is Karen Billy Lewis. I'm from the beautiful island of Antigua. Anybody feeling proud about that tonight? Yeah. All right. I'm a proud mother of six children. I carry that with dignity and pride. Uh, <laughs> speak to someone, gather information, express what you are feeling, and do not internalize. I also have to the back, Canos. Come, come, come. This bracelet, I'm going to be adding um, earrings as well. Um, so, I guess our table is right here to the right of me. <laughs> candles over here, they're natural scented candles made with a premium blend of coconut wax and soy wax. Um, I'm sure many of you are late Francais, so you know bougie means candle. And in English, when you tell someone that they're bougie, it means they have a taste for nice opulent things. Insert my candle. <laughs> so whenever you're ready to ignite your senses, I'll be right over here for the rest of the night. And I thank you very much for being here right today. All right, so the prize are 10 breast covers from Antigua and Barbina.
strawberry. So the total background, I do do custom work for any kind of party favors, which I need to represent ourselves. So a lot of my colors um, right now are for women, but I'm working on some for men and for children. But they will look um, a lot like us, um, crows and braids and um, just natural hair, just anything I can think of, sister locks. So happy to be home. I thought I was doing the most wearing my winter coat, my big parka. Uh uh. The wind outside, wretch arrest. I blew back a couple times. You're probably gonna hear it in his clips, and it's not just because of the door is door. It's really windy out there. So when I asked for a ginger beer, I didn't expect to get ginger beer in a bag. It was frozen. I said, This is the most tempting thing of life. I was so thirsty to the point where I got home. This is my second smoothie after I had coconut water and two cups of water. Crazy, I don't know why I'm so dehydrated. Oh, I know, yesterday. I'm such a lightweight. Anyway, I can't wait to have this. I'm gonna pour a little bit and sample it and then put it back in the freezer. Because if I'm not mistaken, this is supposed to be like an ice pop. So the first time I went to Antigua, I think my grandma bought it for me. It was basically a plastic bag where they pour juice in, they tie the top, they toss it in the fridge. You cut the corner and you suck on it. When your kid is the best thing of life, anything sweet is good, right? But it's so refreshing on a hot summer day. And when I saw it, I was like, oh, got you, but I can't drink that. Here you saw me, I was trying to figure out finagle, but then I thought, mm, I'm already pretty self-conscious. I'm solo dolo and I'm not trying to make a scene if I spill on myself. So let's just leave it alone. I didn't seal it properly, so it was spilling on me. I'm like, why does my coat feel heavy? Ginger beer spilling on the coat on the subway. Is life. Let's go with the flow. I'm going to show you the goodies that I got. I wanted to get more. The vendors were vendor ring, okay? Problem is, I'm not supposed to be shopping, you know? I said I gave up shopping for Lent, but I figured Jesus will excuse me since I'm supporting a fellow Antiguan. I got a couple greeting cards. This one says happy birthday. This one's another happy birthday that says with age comes wisdom. This one is, oh, her thank you cards. I'll make sure that you guys can see her stuff if you want to go over and check it out and support Valentine's Day and Mother's Day. This card is so beautiful and it was not in the pile. It's funny because I picked up another card. I'm like, is this a Mother's Day card? No, it's pride. I'm like, you know what? Let me just take my phone out and zoom in so I can see. She probably thought I was taking pictures of the cards, but I was trying to read what they said. Sorry guys, my camera died. And then when I popped a new battery in, it said the memory was full. So I put the stuff on my iMac, transferred the files, put the card back in. It said that it was still full with no items on the card. I don't know why that's happening. So then I formatted the card, which took a little bit of time. And when I press record, it said the camera overheated. That's when I decided I'm just gonna take a shower and hope when I come back, my camera decides to behave itself. So let's see. The next item I wanted to show you is from Bougie Candles. Hopefully you heard why she called it that. I love that name because you know, I'm bougie. <laughs> this candle is so divine. I wanted them all. I was torn between this one and another one. And she asked me what my favorite scent is. Internal me is like, girl, you don't even know what can of worms you opened up by asking me that because you guys know I'm scent obsessed. I could talk for days for days, but since I was so much in my head, self-conscious and shy, I replied, Woody. And she said, go with this one. And it's ironic because once I zoomed in and saw what it said, because I was smelling them all blind, pun intended. This one is whiskey wood, so the nose knows, okay? Anyway, wait, what's that? I didn't see her put this in here. I don't know what it is and I can't see it. And I, I'm over my, what is this? Oh, the fork. See, stories on stories. This is the second fork they gave me. The first one, as soon as I popped the plastic, it fell on the floor. And I looked at it like, really? You want me to get back up and get another fork as if I wasn't standing up already feeling awkward and self-conscious? 
at least I keep it real with you guys. I knew I would be out of my element and in my head. I just didn't realize how much Stardust would play with me today. If it wasn't my phone shutting off and refusing to turn back on, I hard reset it five times. You want to hard reset it up, down, hold this button for 10 seconds. The apple would pop up and it'd go black again. The last time that happened, I had to plug it into my iMac, but I was in Vaughn and I just sat down. I was like, are you serious? My phone is my everything. I mean, it's everyone's everything nowadays, but especially for me, these are my eyes here. Hello. Without this, I cannot see. So when the guy was asking me the questions on the paper, I said, sorry, I can't see that. I'm legally blind and my phone, I use it to zoom. I don't think he heard what I said. But that fork, so here goes me going up to get a next fork. I asked the lady, and I don't know if she can hear me because I am soft-spoken. So sometimes I don't project well enough. Not only that, she asked the guy to get it. So I was waiting for her to come back and I didn't realize the guy was holding the fork in his hand for I don't know how long because I can't see the fork in his hand because I'm not thinking he's going to give me the fork. I'm looking for the person I asked in their physique to hand me something I can't see. Life is trippy. I did not... It's just, I'm going to make a separate Patreon video about this because it was a whole experience. But the only thing I'll sum up and say here is that if you are living with star guards, RP, cataracts, any type of eye disease, give yourself grace. And whenever you're outside of your natural element, your personal space, your neighborhood, your workplace, whatever you became familiar with, prepare yourself and stay present. I think that's going to be the best way to progress in your life and it seems to me that this is going to be a constant practice. Ten years ago, I would have never had to think twice about someone handing me a fork or taking a picture of a menu and zooming in. Yo, that writing though, I didn't realize that they were combos. So I'm trying to order the rice with the jerk chicken and they're like, no, it comes with the mac and cheese. And I was confused and maybe, maybe that's why I ordered ginger beer in a bag, but <laughs> I don't know. I really don't know. I, it was an experience. I'm glad I went. I hope that I can get back the confidence that I had before and present my best self at the next event because I'm going to try to do more of these solo. As much as I felt like, what am I doing? I came so far from home to feel so far removed, but I was happy to be there and just do something different. You know what I'm saying? And as terrifying as it was, especially coming home and not knowing where the bus stop to go back was, like I mentally took note when I got off the bus that if I'm coming this way, I'm looking for the bus to go that way. But it was a construction zone. It's an unfamiliar area. I'm in Vaughan, which is a completely different city. It's an hour and a half away. Not only that, the bus stop, I was zooming in like this and I couldn't see it. Thank God I left when I left. And I knew something told me it's not done. It's not done for another two hours, but you got to get up, girl, and find your way home. I'm glad I did because I would have been even more stressed if the sun went down. Finally found the bus stop after the bus passed me three times. But I'm home. I'm warm. I'm going to turn the space heater on. And that wraps up this vlog. I hope you enjoyed spending time with me. Thanks so much for making it to the end of it. As a reminder, if you are going through anything, not just suffering with Star Wars, just anything, Give yourself grace, know you'll be okay, and trust that you have the resilience to see another day. I hope that you look forward to the next vlog with me because we're doing something different tomorrow, and that's why I gotta wake up fresh and early, so stay tuned for that. And until next time, stay safe, stay sane, stay blessed. Love and later.